Okay, this is the liquid lemur uh, arch distribution. I'm going to go through the install process and then see if uh, we can get it to boot. tricky on double clicking the icon there. We're in the US and go ahead down to Los Angeles, select next, generic 104 keyboard, US, select our drive, automatically erase and partition. Test, test VM. Select or install Grub. And copy the files. Actually a really nice looking installation, uh, even though they obviously haven't finished all of it yet. And this is still in a, like an alpha phase. Really cool desktop, um, desktop icons. You can see it's running XFCE. Uh, it's got the uh, Cairo dock down here. Looks really nice. Now I have noticed that uh, installing this before that um, they do have a very small mirror list. There it is. One mirror. So before I do anything, before I do anything, I'm going to definitely uh, do the uh, script to uh, rank all my mirrors and get those installed so it's a lot faster on uh, doing the update. It's about halfway done copying. Taking up quite a while to generate. Okay, there we go. Uh, it uses Berg instead of the regular Grub. And now it says the installation is complete. And we'll go ahead and click the reboot button and see what happens.
Some people have said that it actually doesn't go through the reboot. Um, and I believe that uh, during mine, I kind of waited for a couple of moments and then uh, went up to the little start button up here, or the shutdown button, and turned the power off. Go ahead and give it a couple more seconds to try to reboot. Okay, so we'll go ahead and give it the restart button. And I didn't catch it before the CD, so I'll have to do a control delete. Hey, there we go. There's the Berg loader. With a nice new um, graphical interface for Grub. And we're booted into Liquid Lemur. So I think the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to um, pull up the Arch Wiki and get to the mirror ranking section so that we can change that from one mirror to multiples. So and I think it is HTTPS uh, Wiki archlinux.org slash index.php slash mirrors. And then I'm not really going to concern myself with the top part of this. There's a script down here that we're going to just copy. And we're going to go post it into a shoot on by set pacman dot d slash update mirrors dot sh create the password insert our little script save it and we will do a sudo ch mod plus x etsy pacman dot d slash update and now we'll do a sudo actually I think we'll just change to that directory cd it set pacman d and then do an update uh, sudo update Flash update. LS, there's our new mirror list. So now we're going to do a Pacman dash. Uh, we got to do the key init. And while that's generating its key, we're going to actually open up another terminal and do a sudo pacman dash syy to update our databases. It'll tell you that there aren't any databases and it'll build them for you. And now here's where everybody has trouble. So we're going to sudo pacman dash s pacman And we're going to tell it to update. Okay, Pac-Man is at the latest version. Now we're going to do a Pac-Man dash SYU. And this is where everybody gets the error message. Oh, got to do the SU. Or sudo. Okay, here's the dreaded libgl error. So we'll do a pacman, shoe pacman, sudo pacman, dash rdd libgl. 
and then we're going to install it. And it should be version 8.02. Uh, you can see the older version 7.11 and now we're installing a new version. Okay, and now we should be able to do the SU sudo pacman syu and there we go so this will take some time we're going to go ahead and stop the video and then uh, we'll come back and see if it's all successful and we're back uh, it looks like we've gotten all of our files downloaded 266 of them for the uh, Oracle VirtualBox VM installation and now it's just going through all the updates. Um, haven't had a problem so far, so that's looking good. Our mirror was very fast uh, since we updated the mirror list. Instead of one mirror, we've got a bunch of them. Okay, and here comes the uh, grub imaging going on. Yeah, we get ready for the reboot. Okay, here comes the big picture see if it'll actually do it reboot that's a good sign we see the Berg uh, grub loader we'll go ahead and load it up got a graphical environment. All right, everything's looking good. Take a look. Rename dash R. Running 3.2.12 dash 1. Look at that. Looking good. Test VM is up and running. Um, go ahead and do a sudo pacman dash syu again just to check. Everything is up to date and there is nothing to do. So that, my friends, is how you successfully install Liquid Lemur and do the upgrade to the latest version of the kernel and get all the system upgrades done uh, without a hitch. Thanks for watching.